Amanda. All right. All right. To Crystal on your birthday. Happy, Happy birthday, birthday sweetie. And to Toya on her new engagement. All right. I just hope to God this Negro ain't on the run like the last one oh. was. That's all I'm trying to say. You know what I mean? Really? All right, yes. y'all. We're all here together to celebrate my girl yeah, Crystal's happy birthday. birthday. Happy birthday! Wish you good to see you. You look good, yes, girl. Yes, wow. Good. But look, we are here to celebrate. Yes. So if let's it's make your sure birthday, we have a good time. Make some noise. If oh, it's your birthday, oh, make oh, some noise, 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 noise. Yeah. Order whatever you want, girl. It's all on me today, baby. <laughs> and I'm gonna treat you too, sweetie. Oh, yeah. Wait a minute. Wait she go. If we all buy her drinks, then we're all gonna have to carry you home. Uh, you know what? You got a point there. It's okay. I'm really not in the mood to drink. It's your birthday. What, what do you no, mean? No, you better, you girl, you better get a drink. What girl, do you mean you please. don't want a drink? No, I just don't want to overdo it. Uh, okay, oh, but one not. drink is not going to kill you, It's sweetie. not going to kill It's you. not. Trust me. It's a part of the rules. One birthday drink, okay? All right. Are you sure? I'm sure. You okay? Yeah. I'm fine. So, I have news. Uh-huh. I'm getting married! <laughs> oh, <laughs> yes, girl. girl. Yes. Oh Meet the soon-to-be mm, Mrs. That's nice. I know. Wow. Somebody's falling. Uh, uh, my hand is so out. heavy, girl. I've been trying to hold it up all day. That's stupid. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Where did this ring come from? Because you surely didn't have it on when we first mm. came in here. Oh, how you miss this big rock? Girl, it's been on here. I've been trying to hold my hand up all day, I say. All mm. I'm saying is we've been friends for how long? You ain't never say nothing about this. Oh, yeah, She didn't tell me anything, and I spoke to her yesterday. And uh, I talked to you for an hour this morning. Well, I picked the bitch up. Uh, I mean, she's still <laughs> Wait, down. hold up. First off, I knew we was going to get together tonight. I want to tell everybody at once. Okay, okay, well, enough of the guessing game, girl. Come on, spill the beans. So who is this Negro? <laughs> and what does he do? Because that's a big rock. Okay, okay. Yes. Yes. so yes. she insists. His name is JW, okay. and he is in the music industry, so he is bowling. Bowling. Okay. Money, money, money. Shut the front door. Oh, Hold on. gosh. <laughs> what happened to Marcus? Really? Hmm. Yeah. Yeah, that's really. That's the last name I heard. Oh my gosh, y'all. Does it really matter? Where's the support? Thanks for the support. Oh, gosh. Gosh. Listen, Toya, it's not that we don't support you or that we're not happy for you, oh, but you like cannot it. just throw some dude on outside the left field and expect us to be all excited. Mm -hmm. No, it doesn't like come right. on, you know us. Exactly. Who is he? Where did he come from? Looking at me like, what? <laughs> Well, All I'm saying is, who is this JW guy? I mean, I don't know anything oh, about gosh. him. Does he make you happy or what he does or nothing? Like, I what? told you, he's in the music industry. He treats me good, and yes, I'm happy. Happy, 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 okay. happy. Okay. Yeah. Unbelievable. <laughs> no, I can't believe y'all. When Monica said she was getting married for the second time, y'all was happy for her. When Crystal said she was getting married, we flew to a damn island for her shindig. God. Shindig. So that's how you feel. <laughs> Crystal, okay. this is not about you. Don't even try to make this about okay, you. Go. Okay, guys. Okay, 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 okay. Here we go. Okay. Here we go. All right. Here we're we all go. here. Everybody get a glass. Come on. Yes. Because we're here to yes. celebrate. Thanks. Thanks. We're here to celebrate. We're supposed to be having fun. This is a happy time. I need a drink. I don't know about you guys. Get the whole bottle. All right. Gosh. Here we go. Come on. Come yeah, this is just Pour it up, pour it up. Birthday girl. Get the birthday girl. Pour it up, pour it up. Yes. All right. Yes. Break my girl. I'm eating birthday. a little bit since so she don't want to drink yes. today. Uh, you want to drink something. You want to drink something. Yeah, you drink well, yeah something. exactly. Mm -hmm. And uh, a little extra Thank for me. Much. Oh, a yes. little. Oh, yeah. Oh, yes. oh, so <laughs> Absolutely. Oh, okay. That's how she Okay, feels. everybody. Okay. Okay. Toast up. Toast yes. up. Come All on. Right. All right. Yes. To Crystal on your yes. birthday. Happy, Happy birthday, sweetie. And to Toya on her new engagement. All right. I just hope to God this Negro ain't on the run like the last one was. That's all I'm trying to say. You know? <laughs> really? <laughs> right. Mm. Fuck you, Z. It's my life. It's my fucking life. You always gotta start your shit. What? What, what did I do? I mean, what, you, what's wrong with you? You know Toya is just melodramatic. <sighs> Listen, cut her some slack. You know, everybody's here has been married except for her. So maybe she just feels a little left out. Like, give her a moment. Well, I for one, okay... I'm happy that I'm divorced because marriage could have been the worst thing to happen to me. Please. Mm. Could have been the worst thing. Could have been the worst thing. Please. Excuse you. Thank you, Miss Goody Two Shoes. What? I'm trying to help you out. Could have mm -hmm. makes you sound immature. 
Oh, I'm really? To help you out. Oh, really? Well, don't mince your words, Monica. Go ahead and say what you're trying to say. All I'm saying is, you could have been a little more considerate. You know Toya is always trying to keep up with you. I mean, I don't know why, but that's my thing. It is not, not my fault that girl can't keep a man. Great. Okay. Another argument but, on my birthday. <sighs> neither can you. Um, are you serious? Girl, please, go ahead and speak on it. Speak on it, since you know everything about my life. Go ahead. I, I know enough. I know enough that I've watched you through the years throw man after man away like they were nothing. Really, Joe, Terrence, Walter. Girl, please, Joe was dead broke, okay? Okay. Terrence was a freaking whoremonger all over town throwing his dick in anything that moved. Are and, you kidding me? Okay, okay. But Walter, he was nice. I liked Walter. Girl, please, you only liked Walter because he was friends with James. That's not true. He was <laughs> respectful, he had a good job, and he was loyal. Hmm. I mean, what more could you want? Okay, Monica, sure. Well, since you liked Walter so much, then why didn't you screw him? I mean, isn't that the reason why your first marriage ended in divorce? Really? Really? So you had to go there. You just couldn't let this night go without you just had to say Well, I'm something. just saying, you want to be all up in my business, really? then let's put your dirty laundry out. You know what? I can't do this with you. You know what? Like, just listen up. Everybody, listen to me. I'm going to say this one time and one time only. Okay? Like I told James and everybody else. Okay? Mm -hmm. David came on to me and forced himself on me. Okay? And you know what? At this point, I don't care who believes me. Just forget it. I'm it's not about friends. who believes you, Monica. Just it's not, it. okay? It's fine. Just forget it. Bottom line is, if you didn't have that freaking dress on with no underwear, then nothing would have happened, sweetie. I mean, isn't that what your lawyer said, Mrs. Williams? Oh, oh, my bad. You're not a Mrs. Williams no mo. <laughs> <laughs> oh, how do you like language now? <laughs> Very funny. Cute. Come on, come on. Bitch. Monica has been there for you. You know this. All right, Crystal. Okay, 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 okay. All right, all right, all right. My bad. All right, I'm sorry. Mm -hmm. I've been drinking, and I'm a little hormonal, okay? Mm -hmm, Just... mm -hmm. You could have stopped that whore. <laughs> all right, that's how you want to play. All right, cool. On second thought, let me go find my freaking dress and put that on and find me a retired James Williams so I can show him how I can play with balls. Really? How you like that? Oh, my really? God. To it. I yeah. always knew it. You were jealous. You've always been jealous of me. You were jealous of my wedding. You were jealous of the house. My Bentley. Hmm. What finally pushed you over the edge? Hmm? What finally did it, Z? Was it my ring? Huh? <laughs> you are so I misguided, sweetie. I knew it. No, the last thing you it. need to look at, mm. Boo Boo, is me. The last person you need to look at is me. Okay? Really? You're so misguided. Really? I'm not the one really? trying no, to get up you. in your position. It's always been you. I see the way you used to look Monica. at things. I see the way you Monica, used to look at Monica, trust me. Mm. I'm not the one. What? Toya. Monica. Stay out of this crystal. Toya. Mm. Who is JW? Hmm? Who is he? Yeah, who is don't, he? Don't get quiet now, Miss. <laughs> who is he? I didn't mean it, Monica. Mm. <laughs> didn't, didn't mean, mean what? It. You didn't mean it, really? He came to me, Monica. Oh, he came to you. It just happened. Oh, it just happened. You just fell up. I just... <laughs> this is how you do me, huh? You steal my man. It's how you do, this is how you do your friends? Huh? You go behind their backs and you fuck their ex-husbands? Huh? Really? Are you happy now? Are you fuck, are you happy if now, you bitch? Them, you I wanted, wouldn't have to you, do them. You know what? You wanted my life? Now you got it, bitch. I can't, I can't do this. Happy fucking birthday, Crystal. I can't do this. We don't need her. How could you? Why can't I have something for me, Crystal? Wait a minute. How on God's green earth do you think it's okay to marry your friend's ex-husband? He came to me. He pursued me. What was I supposed to do? He's a good man. He belongs God. to Monica. No, he belonged to Monica. He's mine now. I love him. Happy fucking birthday, Crystal.
<laughs> D, you orchestrated this entire thing. You are so evil. What? <laughs> what you girl? knew the whole time what was going on. But instead of telling me, you wanted to create some sort of Real Housewives fiasco. I mean, telling you would be no fun. Where's the fun in that? <laughs> Come on now. I gotta go. Where are you going? Girl, please. I got a date. And uh, for all I know, it ain't nobody's ex-husband, okay? Happy birthday to me. Did you get the invitation? I ordered the cake, and the dress should be here tomorrow. Everything is all set. Hmm. Yeah, girl, sounds like it. So are you coming? Yeah, I'll be there. But I gotta watch this knee girl walk down the aisle with yet another one of my best girlfriends. It's kind of awkward, don't you think? Look, see, I know everybody think that it's wrong, but I swear to you, I didn't do this on purpose. I told him flat out, no over and over again. He just kept asking, so finally I said yes. And it was nice. I believe you. James is fine. Yeah, one date turned into five. Then he took me to Cabo. Then France. It was nice. Uh-huh. And then the legs flew open, didn't they? Why you always gotta make everything about sex? At least I made him earn it. Well, did he at least earn it good? Ah. Uh -uh. Look, I'm not giving you no details. All you want is details just to take on your sex expert show. No. Well, no. Toya, you know I'm gonna keep your name anonymous. Last thing I need is everybody in the entire city knowing all my business. No, no, no. Monica's gonna be there. How are we even friends? <laughs> because I'm impossible and you love me. I don't know why. Because I'm the truth that everybody tries to avoid. Now look. No, don't ask. I'm not doing it. You know, Monica's gonna call it backstabbing girlfriends. <laughs> why? Don't be so narcissistic. You're not the only backstabbing hoe in Baltimore. Gee, thanks, C. Oh, you're welcome. Girl, that goes Shanice. Mm, she look good. Hey, girl. Hey. What's going on? Hey. Hey, Zelda. Hey, Toya. You know, I thought this was our little secret, right? Monica put us up to this spot. Yeah. You know, I'm here every Tuesday and Friday. Oh. Yeah, we're Sundays and Wednesdays. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, girl, I gotta keep this ass down. These thirsty hoes are all over Dougie. Oh, mm -hmm. that's right. You are dating that dude, Dougie Wiggins. He plays for the Redskins, right? Mm-hmm. Huh. Mm, must be nice. I know, right? I mean, I don't know. I think people make too much out of dating a ball player. Didn't you date two NBA players? Tiki Williams and Keith Walker? Yeah, but I didn't let them treat me like a jump off. Hmm. Fly me to Cabo, France, Italy. That's the hookah package. Mm -hmm. You wanna play the game, you gotta know how to play it, okay? <laughs> Shoot, uh -huh. I know that's right. Hmm. You ladies be good, all right? Yeah, make sure you call me, okay? I will. All right. Yeah. Uh -huh. Come on, my turn. Did she just say thirsty hookah package? Uh, yes, she did. Mm. Mm -mm. You think he's playing me? He did give you that big ass ring, okay? Don't forget that. Yeah, but he asked me to head up his foundation like I'm a tax write-off or something. You're looking into this a little bit too much. Check his financials. You are into banking. You do know how to check people, remember? You're right about that. Then just ask him about it. If he tells the truth, then forget about what she says. And if he lies, then he might be trying to game you. I can't believe this. The wedding's in two weeks. Oh my God. Toya, Toya. V, <laughs> you are not gonna believe this. Come on, what's going on? Monica has $30 million in her name. What? Mm-hmm. Remember I told you I was gonna look up James Financial, like we talked about, right? Yeah. And he asked me to be the head of his foundation? Uh-huh. Well, Monica's the head of his foundation now, and whoever is the head of the foundation controls the $30 million. But they're divorced. You don't have to be married to run somebody's foundation. Okay, it's a business. My guess is she doesn't know. But why? 
why would James have that kind of money in Monica's name and she not know anything about it? NFLer James Williams files for divorce from Sandy Stavis. Yep, he's hiding money from his first wife. Oh my gosh. Same thing I said. <laughs> so what you gonna do, call Sandy and cut a deal with her girl? <laughs> girl, no, when I marry him, I'll control that $30 million. Mm, mm -mm. Toya, you gotta slow down. What? You're my best friend, but this is getting to be a bit too much. It really is. What, Z? Just think about it. James comes out of nowhere and proposes to you. Mm -hmm. And then he's Monica's ex. Now you find out he's running the scam. Mm. Don't you see the signs? He's not the one, sweetie. Marriage is supposed to be bliss. Mm -hmm. Friends and family, cake, flowers, beautiful dress, love in the air, mm -hmm. all that sort of stuff. I'm just not seeing it for you, sweetie. Not. No, my niece is gonna be the flower girl. <laughs> girl, you know what I mean. <sighs> all I wanted was somebody to finally accept me for me. Somebody I could call my own. Every time I have a failed relationship, I keep asking myself, what's wrong with me? Am I good enough? Like, why can't I keep a man, Z? It's not you. But when love comes your way, you'll know when it's real. I just don't want you to be like me, girl, because you know I messed up my marriage. You did, you did do that. Okay, look, don't go there. Man. I'm just saying. But Kevin, all he wanted to do is give me the world. And I treated him like crap, girl. Everybody that came along, I swore was better than him. Mm -hmm. I just wasn't ready. So when are you going to break this off with James? Oh, I guess tonight. Yay. No. <laughs> you can do it, girl. And y'all going to call Monica about this $30 million, right? I guess I'm gonna have to. She's gotta be the one to call Sandy. We had so much catching up today. Yeah. Like, it's been so wild since I've seen you. Yeah. You gotta tell me about you and everything and all of that stuff, girl. Girl, and I know you heard about all the craziness that's been going on with me. I told you she would call. Yeah, she keeps calling, but I can't make myself talk to her. She's probably calling to apologize. For what? It's not as if she's going to break it off with him. Girl, she didn't act herself a baller, didn't you hear? She's calling for something. Look, I'm not worried about no Toya and her phony self. And you need to stop worrying about what's going on with me and figure out how you're going to get Dougie back. Me and Dougie are through. Every time I turn around, he up in some hooker face. Mm. Ain't nobody got time for that. <laughs> oh, that's right, girl. <laughs> Oh my goodness, I didn't tell you about me and Nigel. He's hot with me, girl. He did. I don't know what's up with him. Why? Because he overheard me talking to Crystal about how Toya screwed James, and now he all upset about it. He don't think nothing's wrong with that? You know how men are. He thinks that I still have feelings for James hmm. because I'm upset about it. And if I, it wasn't upset, then I wouldn't have feelings for him. Well, do you? Do I what? Care for James. See, now you sound like him. I ain't playing this game with you. Mm -hmm. You still didn't answer my question. Do I have feelings for James? Yes. I mean, he was my first husband. I'm only human. Every time you hear that phone ring, do those feelings from the past come up? No. Every time the phone rings, I feel like that hooker stabbed me in the back and now she's coming to finish the job. If I wanted to finish the job, Monica, I would have just married him. Shanice told me you would be here. Oh. Oh, so I have two backstabbing friends now. Great. Must be my lucky day. Just hear her out. No. Look, I'm not going to marry Jane. And I'm sorry if I hurt you. Girl. Good luck with this one.
Monica, I'm sorry. So you're not marrying James? What made you change your mind? That was wrong. You know, the thought of finally being married, having a husband, a family, a ring, the house, that was all I saw. But I never once thought about what it was doing to you. I know, but everybody knows that your best friend's ex-husband, you don't screw them. Not their ex-husbands, their ex-boyfriends, ex-babysitters for that matter. If it has ex in front of it, you leave it alone, Toya. You have every right to be upset. And I just stopped past to say that I was sorry. Wait, wait, Toya, Toya. Look, I was hurt, okay? I know, but I, I should have never... Let me finish. I was hurt because, you know what? James is a good man. And deep down inside, I feel like the only reason he divorced me was because he thought I cheated on him with David. And I'm hurting. And I mean, I'm not just angry with you. I'm angry at myself because I let David come in and destroy my marriage. Monica, I don't even know if James is a good man. Why? What make you say that? Monica, he has $30 million in your name. Yeah, I know. You do? His first wife, Sandy, girl, she was a hot mess. She screwed everybody on the team. Mm. Everybody had a piece of her. Oh. He was getting in a fights in a locker room. Mm. It was crazy. It was a big mess. That is a mess. And you know, she tried to get him for half of everything he had. So he put the 30 million in my name. You good with that? Look, I just don't want to hurt him anymore. Mm. But look, forget that. What did he say when you, when you broke it off? Girl, he called me a Bama Fi ghetto bitch. <laughs> Girl, you know this is go to. Yeah. He calls everybody that. Yeah, I told him, don't nobody want you with your permanently fungus feet. <laughs> Girl, tripping. What did he say if he said that? <gasps> Nothing. What could he say? He know his feet stank. Girl, Girl and them jacked up toes. Girl, looking like. Jacked up toes. He done ran them suckers out, girl. girl Who did. you tell him? Girl, you uh -uh. already know. You seen them. I don't miss them feet. I, I know. I know. They probably scratched you up. Girl, they probably scratched you. We you probably got the same off. <laughs> <laughs> I miss you, Monica. I love you. I'm so sorry. Yeah, just don't do it again. I'm not going to do it again. X. I promise. X. Nothing with an accident. Gotcha. Remember that. You got to write it on your hand. I got it. Right on my hand. Come on. So, you ladies got any plans tonight? I don't have anything planned. Hmm. You all smiles? That's the smile of a black widow when she got somebody caught all in her web. <laughs> See? What? I'm going out with Dougie Wiggins. Dougie Wiggins? Who's he? He plays for the Redskins. Isn't that... Shanice's man. And Monica said they just broke up, Z. Mm-hmm. Now we know why. Mm-hmm. It's not a big deal. They're not married. Weren't you the one that told me that nobody can date nobody's ex? No, that was me. You really want me to yell at you, don't you? No. Mm. I'm not trying to stab Shanice in the back like you did, Monica. Yes, you are. This is a really good article. So, how did you meet him? Remember the job that my agent got me into, that music video that mm -hmm. I did? Let's get it. Let's get it. Let's get it. It was Dougie's video. Oh. So he raps, huh? You know all those ball players want to rap these days. Girl, they ain't got nothing better to do with their money. You mm. already know. They sure don't. Mm -hmm. But after the video shoot, we went out. Did you screw him? <laughs> you know, Crystal, this article is really interesting. I knew you did. I knew you did. Mm -hmm. Let me ask you something. Mm -hmm. Was it big? Because I hear that all of those ball players have huge ones. Mm-hmm. <laughs> but look at you. <laughs> no, Crystal, not all of them. How would you know? You have all of them? Anyways, mm -hmm. we're going out again tonight. Does Daddy know that you know Shanice? I don't think so. Okay, but what if Shanice find out? So? I'm grown. Okay.
Isn't that? Oh my God, Toya. Hi, you're Toya, right? James's new interest? Excuse you? I'm sorry, I didn't mean to come off so forward. Mm -hmm. I'm Sandy Stavis, James's ex-wife. Mm -hmm. I heard Monica talking about you on Zelda's sex work show. Great show, by the way. Thank you, thank you. Uh, Crystal, I think uh, we're getting called for our massages. I didn't make an appointment for a massage. Yes, you did. There's some cheese and crackers over there too, girl. Come on, oh. come on. Sandy, James and I are no longer together, okay? You mind if I talk to yourself for a minute? I gave him back his ring and broke off the engagement. <laughs> what? Listen, girl. I've been married to him for six years. He ain't letting nothing go until he is good and ready, okay? Look, we got into it and everything. It's over. Done. Trust me. Okay. When you guys first started seeing each other, I bet he kept hounding you until you gave in, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. That's how he does, okay? And do you think someone like that is just going to let you walk out of his life? Girl, please. He is not done with you until he is good and ready. He did the same thing to me, and I did all types of crap to get away from him. Mm -hmm. Can I ask you a personal question? Only if you want the truth. Why did y'all divorce? Listen, um, I know you heard all the rumors about me cheating on him with the entire team, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah. So do you want the truth, or do you want the headlines? Give me the truth. Okay, mm -hmm. okay. Our marriage started off good. Until he got hurt. He became addicted to prescription drugs. We had terrible fights. It was a mess. He was screwing hookers in every city they played in. I had to go to every damn city to make sure my husband kept his dick in his pants. So you're saying that it was James that did all the cheating? Toya, this is what these ball players do, okay? They're in the limelight. They have women over them all 24-7, okay? The best of them cheat. Hell, some wives even have it in the prenup. What? Yes. Nobody can stop it. Many have tried and failed, okay? Just know what you're getting yourself into before you marry James. I already told you. I'm not marrying James. Mm -hmm. Just so you don't believe all the lies, mm -hmm. okay? I was the one who helped James get off drugs. Yeah, and do you know what he did to thank me for it? He left me with nothing and married the trick that he was cheating on me with. Monica? Slut. What? Mm-hmm. And I know he gave that money to her to keep me from getting it. And I have a friend who told me that actually Monica was the one that put James up to it. Are you serious? Yeah. I was the one that helped James. And I deserve half. Okay, it was me that was there doing that. Not Monica. It was me. This is all just way too much for me. Yeah. I don't want any of this in my life. <laughs> yeah, well, we'll see how much you like it when you're walking down the aisle. Girl, it's been real, but I have an appointment to get to. Toya, what did she say? Girl, a bunch of lies. She was saying all types of stuff. I don't believe it. I yeah. know. Who would have thought she would have walked up in here? She said enough to make me think, though. Hmm. I know, right, Sandy, of all people? <laughs> yeah. What's up, girl? That was my doctor. Hey, ladies. Hey, C. What's going on? Hey, Yeah, he took me out. Girl, that's why I had to break it off with him. He's too reckless. Don't worry, we ain't have sex or nothing, Shanice. <clears throat> what, don't be clearing your throat like I'm lying or something? We didn't. I thought you said the day of the video shoot that you and him. Uh-uh, no, I never said anything like that. You did. Oh. Mm, girl, I don't care. He's old news. He took me out because he wants to invest in my sex bird show. He wants to put it on TV. Mm. Look at her getting mm -hmm. all excited. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I am. Uh -huh. Just so sleep with him. Why? He got hurt. <laughs> oh, oh, my God. God. <laughs> oh, Girl, I thought you said she didn't sleep with him. She must have put it in her bowl. Mm -hmm. That's know. bad. Hello, 911. 911. I think I put something bad in my bowl. Now, me, 
maybe you need to give our sex expert some advice. Yeah. You all right, girl? Yeah. Okay. Girl, you talked to Monica lately? No, what's up with her anyway? Girl, don't tell her I told you, but Nigel left her. What? Yes, girl, she is tore up. When did he leave? Two days ago. Well, what happened? I thought they were good. He was already hot about the whole James situation. Mm -hmm. And she just kept on going on and on about what happened between you two. Wait a minute, I thought you told me that you and Monica made up. We did. Yeah, but I think he used that as an excuse to leave her. And just acting like he couldn't get over it. You think he was cheating? Yes, and Monica found out. How'd she find out? They got into it, and he left out, and she followed him to the woman's house. Oh, my God. Yes. I was over there, and she was telling me what happened. And I was like, okay, and then she finally told me who he was cheating on her with. Well, who was it? The real estate agent that sold them that house. They were screwing the whole time? Yes. starting to feel some type of way. I've been calling her, but she hasn't been answering or anything. Well, why am I starting to feel like this is all my fault? Girl, don't even put this on yourself. I know, but because of everything that was going on and... Right, right. She'll be all right. Shoot, Monica's a hustler, okay? But one thing I can tell you is that Monica was not always Miss Goody Two Shoes. She knows how to play the game. Mm -hmm. She married two wealthy men for a reason, not because she's stupid. She got some dirt on her too. It's funny that you say that. That's the same thing Sandy Stavis said the other day when I ran into her. Mm, girl, Monica is my girl and all, but her and Sandy used to be chasing them ball players back in the day, girl. And they used to be getting that money too. I've known Monica all her life. I've never known her to be chasing no ball players like that. Girl, that's how she came up so fast. You know she never got her degree because she left school. That's how her and Sandy was getting that money. And they were friends. They fell out over James. Now this is all starting to make sense. I didn't know all of that. Yeah, Z, but everybody have a past. Look, I ain't trying to judge nobody. God knows I've done my share of stuff. Girl, let me get out of here if I start confessing stuff. Then the police will be all up and through here. All right, girl. All right, girl. See ya. All right. See you later. Girl, that's it. Girl, that is crazy. Yeah, I know. Girl, that's it. Girl, that's it. Girl, that is crazy. Mm -hmm. I can't believe it. Right. Shanice must have left something. Oh, that's FedEx. Have you talked to Crystal? No. What's going on? <sighs> she went to the doctor the other day and um, they found a lump in her breast. Oh my God. Yeah. Oh my God. Girl, it's bad. Yeah. I've been so caught up in my own stuff. I haven't even. I gotta go see her. Yeah, well, she has an appointment on Monday, so. Mm, I know she's scared. I mean, but who wouldn't be, you know? I just told her the other day just leave it in God's hands and you'll be okay. You know? I know that's right. So what's up with you? What's going on? Girl, everything. Everything? What's everything?
Nigel left me for another woman. No, what happened? Girl, I don't even wanna get into it right now. Okay, but I thought y'all was good. I thought so too, but we, we just kept getting into arguments. I'm sorry, you know, I'm starting to feel like I'm the cause of all your problems. No, no, it's not you, he just, Kept picking little fights with me about everything. Girl, the bills, the house, the car, girl, the damn dog. After that, I was like, all right, you know, I can't. You know they do that just to find reasons to get mad, probably so he can go over there and be with her. Mm, that's exactly what he mm -hmm. did. Mm -hmm. You know he used to leave for one, two nights at a time? Mm -mm. Like, come on. Mm. I mean, why you gotta take my man when you can go get a man of your own? Right, so who is she? Girl, Cynthia Baylor, a real estate agent. You are lying. That is so wrong. What did you do when you found out? Girl, what did I do? Girl, I went over there and tried to kick her damn door in. And then I bust all his windows no, out. No, you didn't. Oh, yes, I did. Mm. Girl, I was so mad. Oh, more like pissed. Girl, I mean, like, you're my husband. Right. Why do I have to share you with anyone? Right, that's definitely a no-no. Definitely. I mean, she kept on coming by the house, you know, seeing how we were doing, checking on us. Mm -hmm. Whole time she was coming to see him. And you never suspected a thing? No, nothing. She was nice. Girl, I didn't see or hear anything that was set off a red flag. Nothing? Nothing. Mm. Is she pretty? And young. How young we talking? 26. Stop playing. Girl, brown eyes, big tits, big butt, you know. Typical homewrecker. Girl, but you know what? I wouldn't be surprised if he came onto her with his old trifling, nasty, horny ass. Mm. But I didn't expect for him to go for her though. But isn't it the type that all the men want? He used to come onto the Hispanic chick in the supermarket. Mm. So I figured, you know, he would have been hit one that I'm on the side. You know how men do. So what do you want to do? I mean, I don't know. He left and took everything. Monica, how did he take everything? Because he bought everything, it's all in his name. The house, the car, the bank accounts. So right now, you don't have anything. I mean, I'm still in the house, but he took everything else. Jesus! Aren't you the one that helped him build a construction business? Yes! Girl, I helped him build that thing from the ground Well, what are you up. gonna do? Like, are you gonna do something until you, you know, get on your feet? Are you gonna file for a divorce? What are you gonna do, Monica? I don't know, I'm gonna have to, but at least I do still have James' money to kind of fall back on and pick on uh, until I get back on my feet. So it's just as long as I put everything back that I take out, I should be fine. Why do you have to put everything back? Because that's the way the account's set up. If you take anything out, you can use it for anything. You can use it for houses, cars, mm -hmm. investments, whatever. But you have to put it back. Okay, and if you don't? There is no if you don't. You have to put it back. It's that serious. Okay. So... This is probably like the worst timing, but I have to tell you something. What? James made me the director of the foundation. What? I know, right? It's crazy. He didn't even ask you, me. bitch! Me? What did I do? This is exactly what you wanted all along! Monica, this is not what I wanted. He didn't even ask me permission. I thought you said that you were through with him. I was! I mean, I am! Why do you keep trying to hurt me? Hurt you, Monica! I'm not trying to hurt you. Can't you see that this is James? James is causing all of this, not me. You, ex you expect me to believe that? Because all I see is you going behind my back telling him that, oh, she don't mind if I fuck you. Oh, I would never do that. You know that oh, I would what? never do that. You wouldn't? Never. Please, so you expect me to believe that he just put it in your name? How huh? that up and out the blue, he just made you director of the foundation? You really expect me to believe that? Monica, believe what you want, but I just told you the truth. You told me, you know, oh yeah, you told me the truth. You know what? I'm through with you, the truth, all of this shit. You know what? You ain't nothing but a greedy, backstabbing, lying bitch, and I fucking hate you. Monica! Monica, what's up? What the hell happened? That bitch. James, I don't know what you think you're doing, but this is wrong. She doesn't know what's going on. You need to stop pretending you love her because I know the truth. You think you need her, but you don't. I'm the one that's always been there for you. I'm the one that's always had your back. But if you don't stop this, you will regret it. Mark my words, James, if you don't fix this, you will regret it. 
You think they don't know? They know. James, they know, okay? They know. You think you got everybody fooled, but you don't. And when it blows up in your face this time, I won't be there to save your ass. Thank you for your patience, Mrs. McCain. I'm so sorry I've kept you waiting. It's okay, Dr. Logan. I must admit, I'm a little nervous. It's understandable. I know we gave you quite a scare about the lump, but your biopsy came back, and this is what I wanted to speak with you about today. It's okay. I'm ready. Your biopsy shows you have a one centimeter mass on your right breast, which was determined to be ductal carcinoma. Now, Crystal, this is a very common form of breast cancer. Ductal carcinoma? This is very treatable. You were fortunate enough to come in early for a routine breast exam, and this is why we caught it at stage zero, which is the earliest stage. Uh, Crystal, are you okay? Mm-hmm. Crystal, let me explain. This particular carcinoma is non-invasive. I feel very comfortable we can go in to remove the cancer, and Basically, all what you will have is a, like a two-inch scar on your right breast, but, but that's about it. So what about chemotherapy? No chemotherapy, no radiation treatment, nothing. This is why I urge women to get routine mammograms. It's so important. But can it come back? Well, yes, Crystal, it can come back. If that happens, then what? Well, then we would take another approach to treatment, but we caught it at the earliest stage. So let's concentrate on moving forward, removing it, and getting you healthy again. Okay, so when is the best time for me to call the office to make an appointment for surgery? This is a lot. This is a lot right Crystal, now. Crystal, listen. I understand it's a lot to digest, but I need you to understand the sooner we get you scheduled for surgery and treatment, the sooner you can get back to a regular life routine. Dr. Logan, no, you don't understand. Routine is all I know. I plan everything. And now this, I gotta go. I gotta get out of Crystal, here. Crystal, Crystal, wait. I'll have a care coordinator call you. I just need time to gather my thoughts. I, Crystal, I understand. I'll be in touch. Be sure to do that. There's never been anything in my life that I haven't pre-planned or prepared for. And that's always worked for me. You created me like this. Everything, Lord, from my career, even down to the type of man I wanted. I prepared, I planned for it, and you gave me exactly what I asked for, and sometimes more. Lord, I am kind to everyone I come in contact with, even people that aren't kind to me. I see the good in everyone, regardless of the things they do. And I'm a nice person. Every day, Lord, I wake up. You give me an opportunity to wake up to a brand new day and I'm joyful. I'm excited about a brand new day and what's to come. And I have no regrets about the day before. I love life. I love my life. And today, this is what I get? Cancer? You give me cancer. Lord, I need you to take this away from me, Lord, and heal me. You need to heal me, Lord, and take it away from me. I have so many plans, so many things I have prepared for, Lord. 
I have a husband. I have wonderful people that love me. I have family, friends. Lord, I have a child. What is she going to do without me, Lord? I need you to take this away. Please, please, Lord, I need you to heal my body. Take this away from me, Lord. I planned on being here for many, many years. I planned on growing old alongside my husband. I planned on one day seeing my daughter walk down the aisle. I planned on being a grandmother. I need these plans to come to pass, Lord. You've always done it before. I need you to do it again. I need you to heal me. I need you to take this away from me. Please, please take it away. Monica wish she could be here right now. I know, even with everything that's going on, mm -hmm. I, I wanted to be here too. Yeah. I'm so glad y'all can come with me today. Girl, we just ain't want you running out the door. <laughs> yeah, right. Toya said she was going to tackle you if you ran outside. Oh, she know I will. Mm -hmm. I feel like running. Girl, you're going to be okay, all right? Okay. Listen, when everything is over, we're going to go out, have a girl's night on the mm -hmm. town. My treat. Wait a minute, since when you start treating people? Hold up, I always treat. <laughs> yeah, when it's a tax write-off. <laughs> That's right. How else am I supposed to get my money back? You ain't paying me. Whatever. Anyway. Hi, Crystal. Are you ready? I don't think I'm ready for this. Look, mm. it'll be over before you know it. We promise, right? Yep, and we're going to be right here when it's all said and done. All yep. right? Thank you. That's what friends are for. Love you guys. Thank you. Love you too.